Hi friends, in this video we see about the topic electric potential and potential difference. In my previous video I explained the electric current is the flow of electric charges. In this video we see what makes the electric charge to flow or which is responsible for to flow electric charges. Okay. To understand this question let us consider the example flow of water from water tank. We have seen water pipe in houses and buildings. Isn't it? The one end of water pipe is connected to the tank of water kept at a higher level. The water flow only through when there is a potential difference between the two ends of the tube. Okay. Uh, be, uh, that is it has some uh, dif different value. Okay. So if one end it has some value then another end it has some other potential value. So uh, that is a potential difference is responsible for to flow of water. Okay. So here the potential means ability to do some work. That is the object have ability to some work. Here the work is to flow of water. Okay. Like this phenomena we consider a conducting metallic wire. In metallic wire the electron flow only if there is a potential difference between the two ends. Okay. Uh, otherwise the electron does not flow from one place to another. Okay. So if there is a potential difference between the two ends the electric charges flow that is the electron flow then the current will pass through the circuit. Okay. Now we see how is the potential difference produced in a circuit. Okay. Here, uh, here one circuit is there. In this circuit cell switch uh, lamp and cable. Cable means the wires lamp uh, take a light. Okay. The potential here the potential difference is produced by the battery. So battery is nothing but it is a one or uh, two cells is called the battery. Okay. So it is produced by the battery. Okay, so battery contain one or more cells. The cell has some chemical action to produce the potential difference. So the source of the source to produce the potential difference is the cell. Okay, the cell has some chemical action to produce the potential difference. Okay, now we see uh, uh, the definition for potential difference. Okay, so the potential difference between two points in an electric circuit carrying some current as the work done to move a unit charge from one point to another. Okay. So work done means any object is displaced from one position to another in the presence of force. Okay. So the potential, the definition of potential difference is that is a potential difference between two points in an electric circuit carrying some current as the work done to move a unit charge from one point to other. Okay. So the um, uh, or we can say that potential difference between two point equal to work done by charge. Work done is, uh, is in the letter W and charge is Q. So W by V equal to W by Q. The potential difference is um, represent in the, uh, in the letter V. Okay. So V equal to W by Q. The SI unit of potential difference is volt named by Alexandro Volta, an Italian physicist. Okay. So we can define 1 volt. So 1 volt equal to 1 joule by 1 coulomb. Joule is the unit of work done and uh, coulomb is the charge of, uh, so, sorry, coulomb is the unit of charge. So uh, 1 volt we can define 1 volt equal to 1 joule by 1 coulomb. Okay. So uh, the potential difference is measured by means of an instrument called voltmeter. Okay. So we can measure the potential difference using the instrument called voltmeter. Thank you.